Hey y'all, welcome back. Um, so people have been asking about this wig, so I figured I'd come on here and do a review. Oh my God, my glasses are filthy. I can't see nothing. Hold on. They're not as swollen, but baby, when I woke up this morning, uh, Whoa. Uh, anyways, um, this is the Free Tress Band Full Cap in the style London Girl. <laughs> and I got it in the color 1B. Um, I really wanted some bangs. Um, so this is the wig that I got. It's very affordable. I believe it was $19.99. Um, with tax i think i spent 21 something i threw away the receipt by accident um so i just don't have a confirmation for it um in my christmas tree putting up video i mentioned that i had got it from this beauty supply store in arlington called kiwi it was my first time there um i've heard a lot of stuff about it and so i went there and then this is this is what i picked up um from there and this is the one that I've been wearing it's just an easy cute little style I don't have to do nothing but brush it and go honestly um, that's all I've been doing and when I get home at night I just take it off and I throw it on my bed or on the couch anyways um it's comfortable my hair is like everywhere it's kind of like matted down right now um, but I have on a stocking cap, so I would say that it's big head friendly because it definitely is not, um, I have a lot of room up there. You know, I have a small head, so like it fits, you know, a little bit more laid whenever my hair is braided, but, um, it was just time for me to take them braids out. And then again, like I was having a rough morning, so I didn't have time to do my hair, um, and I had a rough night, so I didn't have time to do my hair then either. So, yeah. But anyways, um, I've had this in since Thanksgiving. I'm going to try to insert a couple of, like, pictures or videos or something of me wearing the hair, like, when I look better than what I do now. Because I've been at work, and I know I don't look that great. I didn't put on no eyebrows, no nothing. My face is dry. Like, I just... Anyways, this is my auntie wig, and I love her so much. Oh, I just, I just love this wig so much. Um, I did want to do the heat test for y'all. Uh, so I have my flat iron here. I will be sure to leave the information for the flat iron down below as well. Um, let's see. I'm just gonna take this piece. And I'm gonna start at the bottom. I have it on 300. So, ooh, that's gonna be a no. That is gonna be a no. So, this hair is not flat iron safe. <coughs> Baby, it just fried those little ends up. Can y'all see that? So yeah, I don't, um, I don't suggest doing any heat. So when this wig is, it gets started getting, really this is probably my last little week wearing it because again, if I cannot put any heat on it, well, and I'm not gonna really do it about it, babies. Oh well, um, it is what it is, but it's still cute for the look. Maybe I'm gonna turn it down some more. Ooh. I'm put on 270D. I don't think putting it on 270 is gonna make a difference. So it's still gonna need time to cool down. Well, all I would just like to say is, um, maybe don't use heat on it. 
you're not getting anywhere, boo boo. Like I really, I should have picked the piece a little further in the bed. Cause now it's just, it feel burnt. Like, ugh. Y'all. Well, anyways, um, it was fun while it lasted. Like I said, this probably be my last little week wearing this wig anyways. It's time for something new. Um, <clears throat> so yeah, that's this wig. If y'all were wanting to know about it, um, not sure where you can purchase this on your own. I don't know. I just say Google it because that's what I do. Whenever I see somebody with a wig that I like, I, you know, I try to look at the little card that they have. So this is the card. Yeah. Um, and this is the video. <laughs> I hope y'all enjoyed this wig review. Um, this budget on the friendly boo. And, um, yeah. I'll see y'all in the next video.